left eye of Tyrell Biggs. That's the same thing, thing probably happened with uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. David Bates. They're toe to toe. It's a terrible mistake. That's something you pointed out before the fight. And now Tyson just hammering him. That's a nasty cut. It's, it's, the blood is seeping to the eye. This requires a lot of work in the corner of Tyrell Biggs to stop that bleeding. The cut is right above the eye. It's exactly in the same place as the last one. Biggs, I don't know what happened. All that gym work has gone down the drain because he's not boxing, not using his tools. He's trying to outmuscle Mike Tyson, which is not his fight plan. And there is a huge left hand. They may stop it. That's a nasty cut. And I don't think I can tell you what a finisher Mike Tyson is. The pressure, the relentless pressure of Tyson yeah. takes its toll. That's a big man. There you see that cut against Ty and that he absorbed against Tyrell against David Bay and here it is right now being worked on. That was a 32 stitch gash that he suffered from Bay. Now let's see if we can catch it as it happens. That's the punch that apparently sliced Bay open. Excuse me, Tyrell. Bigs open. It's the same right hand, Larry, that was thrown by David Bay. Let's remember that Biggs has fought his best when he's been in trouble. But I think it's fair to say that he's not in there against David Bay tonight. Right hand body shot and the left hand behind it by Tyson. Mike Tyson is not just low number one punch. He's trying to put his punches together. He's trying to put together combinations. A mistake he made with Tony Tucker. Tyson Ray, to me, seems to be a little bit more patient tonight. Yes, in fact, he is a little more composed. Uh, picking his shots. But again, I don't, know, I don't know why they don't pick it up in Dick's corner. The way Tyson steps in and leaves his chin so vulnerable. The way I see it now, Mike Tyson has made Biggs fight his fight. So far, the cut has not been any worse. And remember, it was a pretty good job done by Ace Morales, cut man, in the fight with David Bay. But again, Tyson just putting all the pressure on him, having it his way. Didn't seem like Mike was a good short uppercut by uh, Mike Tyson. A little more by the movement from uh, Tyrell Biggs now. Start throwing some uppercuts. He took a big left hand there. And another. The cut is reopened again. Right. Get back. One go, one go. Get back, please. Get back. How does it happen, Ray, that a fighter like Biggs, in this case tonight, will go into a fight with a game plan, and almost from the opening bell, he'll just let that game plan go away? It's all concentration. you got to stick to something that's working for you. And what I see in Tyson, Tyson sticks to his game plan. He works the body with that right hand. He drills a hard right hand to the body and comes up with a good left hook. But Biggs is doing almost everything exactly the opposite of what he said he was going to do. 
huge left hand there by Tyson. And a combination by Tyson, a left and a right behind him. Getting to be a mismatch. Right now, Tyson looks like he's rolling in like the tide from the Atlantic Ocean a few steps from Convention Hall. You had it good, Doc. We're going to be all right. No problem. No problem. Bob, oh, yeah. the brain doctor is taking a look. Oh, I got it all set. But the cut appears no worse than it did. Put your earlier. head back, back, all the way back. You're tested, and you're, you're laying back. You're taking it easy. You can't take it easy with this guy. You gotta keep the pressure on. So you gotta move your hand. All you gotta do is throw the combination. You gotta put two, three, four punches together. Is it Sammy? Yeah. You understand know what I'm saying? He won't be there. He's, He's going to be there. He's not going to be there. One more round. Let's go. And you will not go. You're not nothing. One more round. He's not there, baby. Come on, check it out. And so we start the fifth round, and Tyson is right on his man. Kevin Rudy exhorting him to throw two or three punch combinations. Swelling under the right eye of Tyrell Diggs as well right now. I don't know if Tyrell's going to recognize himself when he wakes up tomorrow morning. I don't know what that was a second ago by Tyrell Diggs. This is somewhat disappointing for Big's corner because he has more talent than what he's showing tonight. The left hooks has been consistent and very, very accurate with Mike Tyson. But they're there for a good reason, right? Well, Tyson, because oh, look what you have in front of you. Uh, the fact that <laughs> Biggs is not doing what he, what he worked on. He just forgot about his game plan, totally abandoned it. Mike Tyson, he's doing what he does best. Work the body, work the head. Simple fact is, and I don't think you have to be a boxing expert, Tyrell Biggs is dropping his right hand, and he's just leaving himself completely open for the left hook. Well, I think this is a good education for the public because the fans at home, because they're seeing what should not be done against a fighter like a Mike Tyson or any boxer or puncher rather in particular. You have to be consistent, keep those hands up. And again, that cut over the left eye has opened up. There is a swelling under the right eye that has a lot of blood right below the surface of the skin also. What Biggs has to do is to work something out which is actually the left jab to break that rhythm and stop the momentum of Mike Tyson. He continues, Barry, to allow Mike to dominate. Yeah, again, bleeding from the mouth as he has been since the first round. Not a pretty sight. He subjects him, himself, Biggs does, to standing toe-to-toe -to -toe and being an active punching bag. This way, this probably see uh, more knots and bruises because... Tyson is hard. Good body shot by Mike Tyson. And remember, the doctor was in Tyrell Biggs' corner and looked long and hard at that cut in the last round, and you're going to see him again. Tyson hit on a break that time. I'm telling you, this is a boxing match, man, a wrestling match, and I say break, you go break, understand? You understand, Mike? So, let's go. That cut looks even uglier. I'm going to look at it. Bloody Friday. 